Hello, my name is Mark Holbra. I'm a director of engineering of Spirant Communications based in the UK. Um, what we're looking at here is the Spirant GSS 9000. The 9000 is a product which we launched one year ago and it took over from our previous flagship product, the GSS 8000. This box, which is, uh, I say, one year old now, has got the capability of being three times more capability than the previous product, the GSS 8000. It also has an incredible amount of flexibility. So, when this thing is completely fully populated, coming out of one of these RF spigots can be up to 10 individual RF channel banks, each of which can be simulating 16 satellites at any L-band frequency and at any constellation. And on a run-to-run -run basis, those frequencies and constellations and channels can be changed. The flexibility comes from being able to procure licenses to add capability to the box, as well as hardware channels as appropriate. What's running alongside it is the SimGen software. SimGen software has been Spirant's key product line for software for, for many, many years. And the scenarios which have been created and generated on previous hardware platforms run equally well on this new one. Also, it's really worth noting that this box can support all of the currently available secure GNSS signals, Y code, AESM code, and PRS. And the overall product can also support inertial sensors. And as you can see from here, in fact, this, this PowerPoint here, um, it's also a key part of our robust PNT strategy, which we spoke about a little earlier.